Hey everyone, perhaps Iran should change its name to Irate because there's trouble afoot in the Middle East after two oil tankers were attacked in the Straits of Hormuz. Well, I've been out that part of the world and I don't see how a bar could have burnt the boat any worse than the day-to-day -day weather. Anyway, the US has been quick to call it Iran as a mastermind behind it all, which seems a bit of a missed opportunity really. Call me old-fashioned, but I would have liked to have seen the US organise a heads of state summit to discuss it all, get everyone to agree to hold it on a train, and then make it the Orient Express, heading to the scene of the crime, with a lengthy reveal at the end whereby President Trump eventually reveals how he solved it all. And by solved, I don't mean the tanker thing, I mean the overarching regional issue, by which I mean a military strike where everyone else was mucking around on a 19th century steam train for the past month. Of course, in the real world, Iran says it, quote, categorically rejects US claims of it being behind the attack. Compare and contrast that, though, with the US perspective that Iran is clearly itching for a fight. It's obvious by the way that it purposely placed its country so close to all the American military bases in the region. I could quote some proper news here, I guess. Quote, the blast in one of the busiest oil routes comes a month after four oil tankers were attacked off the United Arab Emirates, end quote. Now, let's skip to the end here, because really this is all a he said, she said kind of a thing. A topic fairly familiar to President Trump at this stage, by the way. I will say if this incident were to quickly escalate into full-scale war, it would only be due to the Prime Minister's resignation and the UK's paralysis that the country would avoid getting sucked into World War III. Would not be a turn up for the books, eh? If Theresa May accidentally became the best PM ever. Never gonna happen. Anyway, I'll see you next week. If you like these, click subscribe.